seeing this? Have you seen this? Crypto looks positioned to initiate the biggest pump of 2022 so far. But what if I told you? We are about to get filled with a dumpage first. Do you see this chart? Yes, this one. This chart right here that I keep zooming in on? Yeah, this one. You might not like what I'm about to say, but maybe you'll actually love it. Bitcoin is right now on the verge of something spectacular as it has sat around $24,000 for a very long amount of time. But what if I were to tell you that crypto looks as though it's about to absolutely erupt, but it will not be that easy. What do I mean by that? <laughs> Check this out. See you guys in the channel. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn on the these absolutely time sensitive alerts. Take advantage of over $16,000 into trading bonuses below if you're interested in longing, shorting the market, getting altcoins, absolutely gigantic, and uh, reduce trading fees as well for BitGet for a limited time using my link below. And without any further ado, let's dump on in. Unbelievable. Bitcoin right now is sat right at about 24,000, unable to get a daily close above this level uh, once. You can see here, ever since we had this drop down below these levels, we have been unable to get a close at 24,000. And now something very big is happening on these charts. And as I'm sure many of you know, if you've been watching these videos and many other people's videos as well, there are a million reasons why these charts are shaping up to be very bullish with Ethereum uh, doing well, um, you know, with the DXY doing bad, with the entire crypto market going up, with SPX going up. Uh, this is very good for Bitcoin. However, in the short term, I think it's becoming increasingly likely uh, that it's very possible we see a dump before anything else in the short term. Okay, we're talking about a macro run up that could last weeks and months. I absolutely believe that's the case. However, it's looking increasingly likely that we could actually see a dump here uh, first as we've been testing 24 and we've been un unable to really cement it and get it close above 24K. And now it's increasingly likely and obvious that, uh, that Bitcoin could see this move down. And I'll tell you exactly where I believe that would be. So uh, on this chart, you can see we do have some bearish divergence actually as well. So you see the price setting higher highs. We see the RSI actually going down on this daily chart, indicating, I think, a short term possibility for a small dump. And um, so we've been able to reclaim the 21 day moving average, and that's what we've been holding on to ever since we came into the no no zone down here. However, uh, Bitcoin also did struggle to get above this 50 day moving average. And uh, this, in my opinion, is where this dump could take us. Uh, basically right to the 50 day moving average, which is historically also where we built up this uh, support after using it as resistance for the past two months, right at about 21, 21.5. So a little above 21,000. So uh, if we got a dump down to the $21,000 level, guys, would you be bearish? I guarantee you uh, every bear on the planet would be confident in saying, well, we came down from 24,000 to 21,000. Next stop is 5,000. Next stop is 10,000, right? So, uh, I mean, we already see it. Every four or $500 move, uh, bears to the downside, bears get very excited and four or $500 to the upside, bulls get very excited. So it doesn't take a lot of price action to really get people convinced that they are correct in which way the market's going. And it looks as though, in my opinion right now, it's increasingly likely that we might see this move to the downside, especially as we're about to see weekend trading. Now, one thing first before we continue is that the stock market is actually doing pretty good today. The SPX is up again. Um, if we go to this daily chart, you can see another green day so far looking pretty good here. Um, but one thing we do notice actually is the DXY, again, as we've talked about, still kind of bouncing right at this exact level that we've been saying. We have not gotten this rejection yet. And I think it could take you know, a significant more amount of time, at least uh, maybe another week or so, right? It's not gonna happen immediately. I mean, it could technically, but I don't, I don't see any reason why it looks like it's going to at this moment. And remember, all of these macro factors look very good for Bitcoin, right? We're getting a bullish MACD cross on the weekly chart for Bitcoin. We're seeing the entire crypto market break above this historic downtrend line and also getting a bullish MACD cross on the weekly chart for the crypto, the entire crypto market cap. But, uh, and Ethereum as well, looking just very strong. Ethereum looking very good here. But um, Bitcoin specifically, I think could take a little bit of a move uh, to the downside over the next 24, 48 hours here. And um, one thing I do notice as well is a lot of people uh, immediately got very bearish over the last 48 hours as well, um, saying they've dumped, they're out of their positions. And um, I do anticipate, you know, 
in the very short term, we could see a couple multi-thousand dollar move to the downside. Uh, that does not affect anything else that I've been saying in terms of like over the next few weeks. I think uh, over the next few weeks and months, a multi-week, multi-month uptrend is very likely. So all of that's the same. But I do want to point out again, the exact level I think we go down to is right around the $21,000 level, give or take $1,000, right? We could still go below that. Ultimately, if we come back down to 20K and hold that, that's very good as well. So, um, and I kind of, I kind of would like to see a, a retest of that, but uh, that remains to be seen here. But um, I do think it's important to be cautious, cautious, especially as we go into this weekend trading, where, uh, you know, weekends are notorious for being a little wild, unpredictable, and insignificant uh, in terms of determining the longer trend. This is absolutely time-sensitive alerts. Take advantage of over $16,000 in deposit bonuses below when you sign up with my links in the description. Uh, if you're interested in shorting, longing the market, trying to make profit in these dumpy times, absolutely very big. Uh, take advantage of the giant bonuses below when you deposit. Uh, without any further ado, that's it for me.